We're in Italy, you know this already, you've been watching my Uncle Tony extraordinaire, one and only, don't you forget it, a living legend, uh, is going to make us a really wonderful dish, linguine with shrimp. Yes. He's going to show us how to make great, he's a phenomenal cook, owns many restaurants, always has, legend, iconic. So now we're going to start. Okay, you want to come closer? Okay. Fine, you, you, okay. you do what you want. Let's get some oil. Okay, he's gonna do the, the base sauce first because yeah, right. if he doesn't, and he does the shrimp and then adds the tomatoes, you're gonna end up with really hard shrimp by the time right. your dish is done, right? Yes, you're right. You can explain anything yes, along the way. Okay, we got some garlic, we just like this, we like that. Do you know something that's a big misconception? that people do all the time, that people don't understand all the time, is that people think that Italians love a lot of garlic. But that is a misconception. It's not true. It's not true. It's like, what happens if you get garlic in your mouth? I don't like it. I don't <laughs> like it at all. I take it off all the time. You because always Because I don't take... like it. I be like, oh. but it's good for your health. It is good it's for you. Good for... So if people want to eat it and they can eat it, yeah. they can eat it. You it's, know what it I mean? For because it's good. Yeah. It's good for your health. It's very but good. Most of the time it's squashed and then they retrieve it so that no one accidentally eats it. Yeah, you're right. See? Big misconception. When I cook with garlic, it's to my taste. But Italian Italians, not American Italians, Italian Italians don't like a lot of garlic. You didn't know that? Now you do. I always say it. People don't believe me. Okay. If you want to okay. get closer to see, he's just going to yeah, saute. Saute a little bit of garlic. Little, we're going to get a little brown. Then we're going to get this beautiful tomato. Chili tomato. Datterino. They're Look nice. like this. They're Look. so sweet. They're so sweet. We always talk a lot about the difference in flavor and, uh, and produce and fruit. Yeah. And... Something that I think is, people will say, "Why I went to Italy and the food tastes so different, but the ingredients are the same. It's not the same quality, especially from Naples to yeah. other places. And it's beautiful, isn't it? It's a little brown. There you go. We put tomato. Okay. A little pay attention when we do this job. There you go. It smells very good. It smells good, yes. Okay, now what do we do? We put a little bit of basil, fresh basil. We wash a little bit. Like this. Oh, that smells so good. It smells so good already, see? And then what we do, we just put a little bit of water, a little bit. By the time the tomato gets cooked, okay, the water is, is going to go away. How do you say when it evaporates? The water will evaporate by the time evaporate. the tomato is cooked. And the tomato is cooked. So basically, the water like helps this. the tomato cook down. So by the time the, the tomato has cooked down, the water will You're have right. evaporated. And, you, and the, the tomato gets cooked, the perfect. Yes. So we're going to put a little bit of salt. Like this, a little bit because the shrimp, we gotta test the shrimp first. Just shrimp. a little bit. Shrimp, no shrimps. Shrimp, right? That smells there amazing. Let it cook a little bit. How long do you think? Ten, five minutes? Ten minutes? Well, maybe ten minutes, yeah, ten minutes, a little bit. Medium okay. heat, ten minutes. Yes. It's lovely, it's lovely. No hard, no, not very flame, slow, slow flame. Okay, sauce is cooked down. The tomatoes are just about fully cooked down. 
Now we're gonna set this aside because we're gonna saute the shrimp. Um, and and olive oil. And olive oil and garlic and chili. And a little bit chili. But this just has to set aside. Now we're gonna move on to the second step. Okay, what are we gonna do now? Just saute the shrimps in olive oil, garlic, little chili peppers. Just a little bit because I don't want to fire in my mouth tonight. <laughs> there you go. Okie dokie. Just like that. So you put your garlic. Qua. Okay, right here. I take one. Ci faccio un buco piccolo, no? Okay. And then I put the whole thing. Okay. And then you take it out. Well, wow, perfect. You don't. You can, can do, do that. Like this, no problem. Partner. You can do it like this. This is very big. This garlic. Just take um, a puncture okay. so that it doesn't explode. That's cool. And then you just take it out. You get a little bit of the heat from the outside, but no seeds, no veins, no seeds, no nothing. Okay. Awesome. Go ahead. Wow. There it is. There it is. Wash my hands, garlic. Wow. Can you explain to me what these shrimps are called? Because do we have something like this in America? This Probably is from Argentina. Do. This is Argentina swing. Okay. I know Trader Joe's the, does have Argentinian shrimp, but they're not whole like this. It's usually just the, the tail, but the, the flavor is in here. Uh -huh. The flavor yeah. is in the top. Okay, and I'll show you now how we're going to make this one. All the flavors, we just put in, a, in here, and then when we put the sauce, you're going to break this. Yes. And all the flavors come out. And so the, the sauce take Take the test, you know what I mean? Yes. And what we did here, we just we cut, took a, cut few. a few, maybe they are four, I think. I chop them up. So we do a little bit of this, and not together, oh, we put this one, the whole thing That's inside got a lot the pan. Okay? Do you know what I noticed I that you, you don't do? What? The, what I don't do? I do? You don't put any wine with your seafood. No, no way. Fresh. I, Everything's fresh. I like no a little wine. bit of wine. No, but no. You don't. For me, as a test of uh, fish. Sea. Yes. Like the sea, you know yeah. what I mean? Sea. Yeah. Mare. No, but, no wine. But you know We why? drink the wine. I drink the wine, but I, I don't put in my seafood, the fresh seafood. No way. But you know what I think? No way. I think I am used to adding wine because our seafood in America does not taste the same. You yeah. know? Yeah, but you can try maybe, I don't know, I don't like, I drink wine. I don't put in my seafood, sorry. He does not put wine in his seafood. He <laughs> no does way. drink it. I no way. I just noticed that. Because every time no you way. make one, you don't add any wine. And it does taste better. Because then you can I like, taste the I real like the flavor. Test the sea. I like the test the sea. You know what I mean? The Mediterranean. You know? Yeah, yeah. Okay. The garlic is ready. So what do we do? We just put the cream in. Like this. Look. It gets rosy. They already rosy, but they get more, more rosy. They're already pink, but they'll get yeah. really beautiful. Yeah, right. There you go. And can I say something? Yes, anything. See, now, like, uh, everybody thinks it's difficult to make seafood. For me, it's the easier. Because olive oil, garlic, a little bit of spicy, and here you go. And the fresh tomato, it's ready. Look. It smells so good. Look, look, look. I don't want to put a wine in here. It's, oh my God. Okay, see? It's nice and rosé. See? It smells so good. Okay, now what we do, we just put tomato inside. May I? Okay. So the tomatoes are already F, F cooked. So what do we do? Just like this. Okie dokie. Oh my god. Yeah. Wanna put put some parsley in? So Yes. It's please. we're almost ready. We're gonna break yes. we're gonna break the, the, the head, okay? So all the juice. Look. You see this? It's you see? it's the flavor. It's the flavor. A little bit. And, and you see now. Look. See it? I always prefer to cook my seafood with like shell See? on. Because uh, that's what and The only way, is. if you don't do this job, it's going to taste like tomato. That's it. Uh, we don't want that. 
If we want just tomato, we make just only with tomato. Then, when you eat, you just go like this. When you eat, it's good. Best test. The best. Okay. Okay, this is Angel. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna add a little bit of chopped parsley. Okay. Okay. It looks good. Gives you oh the flavor. Oh my god. You know what? It. I already tasted it. It's <laughs> great. Come on. Okay. Wow. It's incredible. It's incredible. Like, well, how and many now ingredients now is that? Now it's ready. We shut it off. We're gonna put the pasta, and I show you it's. I'm gonna just put the pasta. Unbelievable. On. We'll put the pasta on. But you can already see that it's consistency. I shut it off now. You can see yeah. that the sauce is not thin. Yeah, it's uh, almost uh, uh, thickened. Yeah. It's, it's okay, thickened. okay. Now we're gonna put the pasta on. Okay. Okay. Now the water is ready, boiling. I already put salt in, okay? Now we are like six people. We are very hungry, so we're gonna put about seven entry. How do you say? Like, like uh, 750 grams, which are like a pound and a half. There you go. Yeah, very salted water, like the Mediterranean. What? Okay, we'll save this for next time. Okay. This on. We told. Well, the pasta is going in the water. All in the water. There you go. And when it starts boiling, we move it again. There you go. The pasta is almost ready. What I do now is take it off the screen. Put it here. Leave a little bit here. Okay. He's going to take this, the large shrimp out so he has room to, to, to toss this pasta into the sauce without breaking the large shrimp. Wow, right. You're right. Okay. There you go. Now I have to put the pasta this way. Let's do this way though. Okay, I have to, how do you say, uh, just you have to drain it, you have to drain, drain it, pasta. Hold pay on. attention please, this, just like this, there you go, come with me, we want to put, now down, leave me, look, Okay. Wow. Let me take this out here so we can look better. Leave it here. There you go. Okie dokie. Attention again. Okay. This is making me it's nervous. Very, it's very hot. It's very hot. Go ahead, Laura. Okay, we're gonna do Put, a little lemon yes, zest. Yes, a little bit, a little Which bit lemon like zest. Secret. You're right. Okay. How, how I take this off though. I don't want to eat them all in one time. Quanto ne vuoi? Questo è fina, fina, fina. Quanto ne vuoi? Okay, a little bit more. How about be enough? It's good. It's good. Okay. It's good. And I show you what a test we have. We don't have the right the right equipment, so it's okay. You're gonna make it. Wow. Beautiful. We put a little bit more on. Very hungry. Me too. I'm hot and I'm very hungry. Okay. Okay. Then you can take some of the the, the goods, you know. Yep. Yeah. Like this. What are we doing like this? There you go. Okay. Okay. And now what else we can do is just this. Look at this. A little bit. A little bit. A little bit. You can do it like this. That is perfect. That is perfect. Okay. See you. That is perfect. I'm about to take a fork and go downtown. Wow. To flavor town. That is perfect. Thank you very much. Thank you. Wonderful. Thank you very much. And next time, linguine with shrimp. We'll Gamberoni. I'll do my best to, to write the <laughs> recipe for the website, but can't promise anything. However, I hope you've enjoyed spending time with us. We will see you in the next one. Bye bye.
Yeah.